Hello there, Madrahill. Welcome back to some CK3. It is the Byzantine Empire. Hope you like my terrible name placement. It's garbage. It's It hurts me so. You want to know what else hurts me so? How about the fact that Scotland owns Norway? Why does Scotland own Norway? P please tell me. He hasn't made the title, however. What's happened? How has this happened? They're not different religions. They're, s they're the same religion. There's actually... Still a Norse. I thought I'd just have a little second here and just take a look at some of the differences going on right here. And like, you know, how the world's set up. There is still some Norse. Ah, uh, no, there's not though. Look. He oh, I'm sorry. He's Catholic. That's his culture. Eh, gross. He's also club footed. And Lapland owns Western Ireland. Oh, I don't even know. There's a little bit... Oh, no, I was about to say that's Catholic, but no. Wait, what? Mualdi Asturinzie. That's an organized Muslim faith. The Duke of Lyon is a Muslim. But he's of House Yemena. What? The fuck? <laughs> Did they get converted? They must have been forced converted. They've all been forced converted. Oh my god, this game is cursed. So cursed. Oh well. Uh, we've managed to do pretty well. Hey, and what's up, buddy? And we are just kind of continuing to move on here. We are currently fighting a war for the Dauphinate of Viennois. Once we've done that, we're going to just continue to push down as well into Hole of Body to try and stay alive as long as possible. We are 60 years old right now. My son is pretty tight. But I would prefer, to be honest, to play as Bethos, who's beautiful and intelligent. I hope, anyway. Who is his ward? Because he's going to be... I didn't realize he's actually going to be my, my heir, Bethos. Um, wait, what? Where are you? Why are you not in my court? Located in Voldemir? What? Who's your ward? What? What are you doing? He has no character as a guardian. I think that probably might be a bug. That's a little bit annoying. Uh, okay. Whatever. Who knows? Um, we want to try and keep expanding and pushing into Italy. The problem is that they have 12,000 men and 63,000 monies. So while we can certainly raise up quite a lot of soldiers, it's just going to take a very long time to get it together. Old ruins. While on the road to care of some business, we stopped at an ancient ruin to rest. It's supposed to be a stewardship event. That's weird. Um, the ruin is relatively small in size and doesn't cover a large area, and not much remains. I stroll around it for a bit and examine its walls, which appear to have some kind of artwork or carvings. Most is too weathered for me to figure it out, but does remind me the place must have looked gorgeous. Monthly lifestyle experience, 8%. Oh, I think that's one of my uh, the mod I've got, the extra events mod. Um, my nephew, Despot Filetros, who is of my own dynasty and is a scarred flagellant with 22 learning. Beautiful. He was slain. His father was slain in battle. Oh, that was my great Georgios. He's created a faction to install Poshera. Hmm, why are you doing that? This is Princess Poshera of Georgia. She is married to some pleb. So how about no, mate? What are you doing? What are you doing? Luckily, most of the important people are here. Uh, my cousin, Despot Focus of Syria, just created an, another Cadent branch, which is interesting, of the dynasty of Komenos. And that is the piece. We just captured a lot of people. Oh, yes. Yeah. So we can actually, um, because the war score is over 100% for holdings, we can actually just start to ransom all these people. So we'll do that. Unhealthy relations. My lord, the malady is contagious. My core physician holds me back. The diseased body of a commoner, skin marred by rashes and bumps, rests upon the table. Anyone who comes into contact with the corpse risks infection, and I was planning an outing that will take me close to Capua, the holding of my rival and vassal, Countess Cecilia. Ooh. Why is she my rival? Launch it towards Capua. Becomes my nemesis. Might contain vital clues. Learning plus two. Hell yeah. Yeah, I'd rather learn. Great. Acquaintance taken prisoner. King of Vladimir. 
has taken of Novicel. Mm. We might need to go a little bit further in that realm. But that's good. We've just taken this entire... Oh, he's just become my vassal. Obviously, he's not my biggest fan, but that is beautiful. We can start to usurp small areas now. Cannot usurp the top. Oh, I can't usurp it then, can I? Why are you lying? One or more buildings in Ardell is disabled. The Chateau. Because it is... The building has been disabled because the Duchy of Province is not held by you. This is a Chateau, a Duchy building. All your holdings in Duchy control growth point 2. Okay. Where is this? Oh, do I not hold the Duchy? Oh, I'll just make it then. Go on. There we go. It will re-enable next month. Great. Uh, we can change Tetris Kiriki's contract. No, that's fine. Some ransoms and alliance with my cousin. That is fine. Always a good idea to go through things here. My daughter, she can do that. Do, 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 do. Great. What did you study your videos? So actually for most of my Let's Plays I do almost no editing on them whatsoever. Um, for my edited content I do use Sony Vegas to edit it. Uh, just because of what I'm used to, to be honest, I really think I should probably use something else because I have a lot of problems with Sony Vegas, to be honest. I find it not an especially good program. And I really would like to move to something different, but I've just yet to do so. Why can't I make the Duchy of Burgundy? The Kingdom of Burgundy. Oh, I have. I have made the Kingdom of Burgundy. Fantastic. Um, since I own pretty much half of the important stuff, I'm going to keep it. No real reason not to. I also have Yedison and Armagnac. I think we should give this away to someone. Someone relatively useful. The guy's 53 and ambitious, and so maybe not. Oops. Just someone who will hold the title as a dwarf. Do you like me? Yeah, he's alright. He's got a ton of titles. He's probably going to get it eventually anyway, or usurp it from me. So I'm just going to grant him the Duchy of Yiddisan. There you go, my lad. That'll keep him happy. Excellent. Always a good idea to try and keep people happy. Ah, So there we go, we've got another lovely kingdom. Uh, and in terms of other things, not a lot we can grab here. Now, we do have a variety of very useful claims here that we could press, but most of them are pretty garbage. When I say useful, I'm really lying. And if I want to form... I feel like this episode is mostly just me clicking, going, mm, which one which would I click? If I want to do the Roman Empire, which is the first one, I'm not yet a living legend, so I'm not going to be able to do it from this life, but I need Latium, which is easy enough. Cromania, which is up here. Puglia, which I don't have 100% of. Palestine, Tunis, and Croatia. So to be honest, we're very close. We're very close. Um, we probably do want to declare war on this chap once my armies are done. Nice. We also do need to get a little bit more of Palestine. In fact, we actually own very little of it. Unworthy peasants, let him keep his place. My vassal and ward. Is he not my... He's my dynasty. Yeah, arrogant, fine. Don't have a Cassus belly. Damn. Would that I could seduce her. Could I seduce her? Zero percent. Opinion of me minus fifty. Deceitful dislikes, honest. Why do you hate me so much? Ah, you want my shit. Fair enough. Oh wow, three hundred ducats, nice. Well, uh, yeah, the problem is I do need all of Palestine, so I'm gonna have to take it from you. I'm really sorry. I open my eyes in the dark. I immediately have one by an ominous feeling. Are you ready to embrace the truth, Zenobius? It is Ilionius, the courtier of him. The horned god offers you his blessing. With all my heart, I become a witch. Okay. I want nothing to do with this, or the world will know of your sin. I've never been a witch. Let's see what happens. I've literally never been a witch. 
Let's see what it does. Do I get any cool things? I can found a witch coven. Right. If I have a witch... My son has to be a witch. And a bunch of my household have to be a witch. That's, that's not going to happen then. So nothing happens? That's a bit boring. Can I, uh... Can I convert him to witchcraft? Go on. Let's try and convert him to witchcraft. That could be fun. We will attempt to fix our... Uh, get our army back to where it needs to be. We're nice and rich, which is lovely. I'm going to continue to invest... Into the country. Got a lot of bloody ransoms. With certain promises, I can salvage this. My daughter-in-law. Oh dear. Oh, don't be like this. What have you done? You're sleeping with this douchebag. Oh. Come on, man. I married you because you were beautiful. And that's pretty much it. Ah, oh, this guy became my chancellor. Luckily, he's got a lot of, tra lot of traits. I've got Genoa. What else do I need? I need Romagna. I really wish this would give me claims. I don't have any cases bellies, for goodness sake. So I need to get Romagna. So I think we're going to have to make a fabricated claim onto Ferrera. So let's do that. Great, that'll get us Ferreira. And then we need to think about taking the rest of Puglia as well. I can't force him to see the truth, so I don't know I can to open his mind. I must go up to him to extend the invitation. He deserves to make up his own mind. I watch the sleeping shape of him while I send a quick prayer to the horned god. Hey, what's up, Jetstream? Nice. Awesome, buddy. He stirs. I step out the shadows and offer him his blessing. There's no fear or hesitation. Okay. Learns of my secret. I can finally show him my true self. Alright, that's really weird. So, he is now a witch, but I have to convert a lot more of my adult house members. So let's start going to my house. How do I find it? How do I just go to specifically my house? Because this is house Alderhill. I have 43 living members. So if I just go Alderhill only. Okay. Queen of Denmark. Nope. Alright. Michael, my cousin. Nope. <laughs> my despot of Georgia. Yes. 5% because of his personality. Fair enough, and you can only click it once, and then it gets rid of it for ages. So I have to one by one. Okay, um, and we're also gonna go alive. It's fine. Okay, Princess Pulchea. Perfect. So one by one, we will convert everybody to a witch. <laughs> I received a missive from Sultan of Cairo. He claims that Countess Alexia, Alexia has requested support in a plot. I will confront her in person, or I will publicly accuse her. What does she own? She owns Palermo. Um, I'll just confront her in person. Get wrecked. When I present the letter, you believe his word over mine. Have I not always been your loyal servant? In fact, I will, you have always been a good servant. What Sergius says. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. That didn't go well. <laughs> Turns out he was just lying. What a douche. All right. I've got a ton of cash now. I think we should think about raising up more levies. Not levies, but increasing the number and density of our man at arms. And so we already have Cataphrats, we have Bowmen. I just want to see if there's any that... Ah! Crossbowmen! Yes! Excellent. Nice, beautiful Crossbowmen levy. Increase them up to 500 straight away. Eh, 700. Why not? 
Always good to do that. And we're just going to keep developing our stuff. All right, and that's a claim on the county of Ferreira. That should be all we need for the Roman Empire. And yeah, that's fine. He's actually my brother-in-law, interestingly, because he's married to my sister-in-law. What? What? Ooh. Oh, anyway, I guess that's why. Okay, so if I declare war, my claims, I will gain the contested title. So I only need that. Good. Then we need to just get rid of a few extra rally points. There you go. Raise up the locals. You get my hit area. He's good at sieging and just finish that. I was shocked when I caught Prince Mateus of Nikia, who is my cousin. He has two counties. Oh, he's not even in my dynasty. Oh, no, he is. I caught him trying to steal. Okay, honestly, he'll serve you best. Yeah, why not? I believe he's doing better. Yeah, no, he's doing, I believe he's doing well. Thank you for asking. You must see K3. I'm sorry I missed the start. That's kind of you to acquire. They're nice. Hope you're doing well, buddy. Yeah, we're good. Actually, we'll be seeing Olivia tomorrow, hopefully, on um, some C CK3? No, not CK3. What's it called? Game of Thrones board game. So pick up a mind. Boop. A new novice. And so, yeah, it'll be very fun to be playing some, C uh, some Game of Thrones board game. Looking forward to that. On Ransom. So we need to... How many do we need? Because I think, yeah, we only have 13%. So looking again, just kind of going to go through. It just takes a few years, but we'll just slowly but surely get it done. The Great Duelist. My vassal has arrived at court with a bandaged arm. My daughter has been challenging people in duels all over Upper Burgundy. It says to stop. She turned up my doorstep and challenged me. It's not the first time either. He's got a wound. Why? She's 25 and quick. The duels will cease at once. She will not duel anymore. A dangerous pastime. You need an instructor. Your father will show you how it's done. Prowess challenge. Uh, you need an instructor. Absolutely, you're, you're cool. And I think you also do need to marry someone. Like, you do quite clearly need to marry someone. I'll go matrilineal only for you. Someone... There's not really anyone worth it, to be honest. You know what? You can just stick around here. You're pretty cool. I like you. You're going to stay here. Uh, da -da 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 -da. I'm good. You did not stream? Yes, sorry. I should say we're going to be doing it on stream tomorrow. Apologies. I'm just kind of... Oh, yeah, I'll be doing this. and didn't actually say when or how. To the modest Basilios, I call you to honor the alliance in the Dijon of the Duchy of Gadzaglugablagablugal. Fine, I guess. Whatever. Guess I'm there. Oh dear. I'll be working with you like, thanks buddy, I appreciate that. Hey, there we go, contributing to the live Q&A, very nice. Almost done for the war, I think. Acquaintance taken prisoner. Nah, I don't care. Betrothed can marry your nephew and grandson. Who are you? To this person, who is a dwarf. Oh, that's the dwarf. Yes, I'm trying to breed a line of dwarves. Because he's Herculean, right? Yes, look at him. A d Herculean handsome dwarf. And she's a dwarf. Yes. Look at him. Oh. oh, he's beautiful. He's beautiful. His brother, unfortunately, is a hunchback. His other brother is sterile. His other brother is a bleeder, and his sister's sterile as well. That's unfortunate, but he's going to be the chosen one. We're going to mark him with special interest. There you go. I've not won this war yet. Come on. Oi. Bye bye. 
Right, and that's the piece. And I guess I am fighting the... Oh, no. I'm fighting Hungary and Lithuania together, aren't I? Ah, oh, you sod. Look what you've caused me to have to deal with. Fine, I'll go fight them. Time has come. Good. And now we just keep kind of going through and checking everything to see if we convert people. All right, in the next episode, we're going to keep working on trying to convert as many people as possible into being the glorious witchcraft. I honestly don't actually know what it means, but we're going to find out. I was Aldrigan TG, and it's been CK3. Bye-bye.